So... Today, guys, we're going to be taking a look at some complete bag pieces of... God damn, I hate these guys. This is a channel called Robin Burl, and it is the worst epitome of terrible pranks on YouTube. Let me just say, first of all, it doesn't make sense. You can't have a channel uh, where you're a couple and you are constantly pranking each other. It's so obviously fake because if you're pranking each other every day, there is not a single chance you are going to believe the other person's prank is real. <laughs> it's ridiculous. So, if you enjoyed today's video, please do leave it a like and subscribe if you want to help support me and my channel. Patreon and Twitter links down in the description as well. The latest Patreon exclusive is uh, part one of a Hollow Knight playthrough. These are the kind of videos you can get if you join my Patreon. I try to upload at least two Patreon exclusives every month. I've got a lot lined up, so they're the kind of things you can get by joining my Patreon. I'm also going to be bringing back the fan art section, so let's quickly take a look at some wonderful fan art. So, this piece of fan art coming from Joey, first of all I'm going to point out the colours because that's like the big main aspect I really like about this. They've gone for very cool cold colours uh, in a pink and blue kind of style and obviously uh, if you haven't noticed by now my channel is filled with pink and blue much like this t-shirt. Um, it's a lovely blend of different colours. So uh, I really like it, you've got my Atlanta hat which unfortunately is dead at the minute, it's kind of squished and muddy. But yeah, really like it, I love how big my eyes are, um, I like the way you've done my beard and moustache combo, uh, it's nice and jaggedy and edgy and I like that, same goes for the hair. I, I really, I think you've done a wonderful job here, proportions are all looking nice, I really like the way you've done my nose, I like it. I wish I had less of a bridge like that. Anyway, um, yeah, I think it's really good. So thank you so much for doing that. I really do appreciate it. Right, let's move on to some <laughs> kind of content. Hey. Oh, I've magically changed clothes. That's because it is the second day. So, um, yeah, we're going to go right ahead and take a look at Robin Burrell's channel. And uh, I want to show you some of these thumbnails because they are, they're just... They're just unbelievable. They, they've actually completely blown me away. And I don't get blown easily. Wait, wait. Hold. So, take a look at this, guys. <laughs> so, th this is now a guy and his girlfriend pranking each other every day. But you can't bloody well do that. Because if I was with someone and they were pranking me every day, I might clock on after one or two pranks that they were pranking me yet again. And what, what's that? Is that a big camera or a tripod? What's that doing there? I don't, I, I don't remember that being there. And is, is that another one? Is that my D5500 on a tripod over there recording? No? Ah. Oh. Must be, must be my imagination. So, like, for some of these pranks, yeah, it seems like at first she's a bit shocked or he's a bit shocked. But then, you know, there might be a little bell ringing in your head saying, "Ah, I think this might have happened before. I think I, I think I remember this. I think it's, I think this is a prank. One of those prank things that happens to me on a daily basis." So another thing you might have noticed about these thumbnails is. Why does he have to be shirtless in every single one? Why are they in bed in every single one? And yeah, again, it's, you know, manipulating each other for the thumbnails. Here's a picture of the girl with a, a hickey on her and she's just shoving her boobs up. Can you see the hickey? Can you see it? Can you see the hickey there? Can ya? Ooh, yeah. <laughs> so it's silly. And okay. I'm gonna, you know, there's an elephant in the room, and it's this thumbnail on the top right uh, hand. Period prank on boyfriend, and just, just look at that thumbnail. Nah, what is, why? It's just her with blood all up the place. Because that's what happens on your period, isn't it? You just sort of lay there and like, roll around in your blood, and it's all over your clothes. What? Like, what? I don't even know if I can show you that thumbnail. There's also one here that says toaster electric shock prank on girlfriend. That's nice, isn't it? That's 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 a kind, uh, warm-hearted prank. 
What happened to like putting a bag of flour on a door and they open the door and the flour drops down? No, now you have to involve yourself being viciously harmed, maimed or murdered. Like, come on. I mean, look at this one. If you search Robin Burrell death, look at that top one. Dead prank on my mum. Backfires. Whoa, as if that's a celebratory thing. It backfired. Isn't that cool? My mum's had a heart attack. <laughs> She hasn't, though, uh, and this isn't actually a prank on their mum. It's one brother pranking the other brother, and the mum's in on it. So the idea is they lay down, look like they've been murdered. The mum comes in, she passes out, um, and then the brother is then led to believe that he's caused his own mother to have a heart attack and might die uh, by his hand. <laughs> yeah, got ya! What about mow down my friend with an AK-47 prank? Ha ha, you're dead! You won't ever see your family again because you're in an... Ha <laughs> 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 ha, you're dead! No more life for you, buddy! Pranked! Gotcha! <sighs> but obviously these aren't just like pranks for the fun of it. This is a factory line of vapid, meaningless videos, each one as vapid as the last, not really adding anything, it's just they're made to manipulate people and to make money and numbers. Ooh, I got the highest number, oh no, no, I do, I've got more subscribers than you, oh no, well I get more likes than you, uh -huh, I got the biggest number, not you, ha 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 ha. It's just a bit like, it just makes me a bit sad really. So, let's take a look at Dead Brother Prank, Knife in Toaster, Give CPR, whoa! First thing you'll notice are the likes. This is just absolutely plastered with likes, so people love this. People love seeing people faking their own deaths to, to their, their close family members, scarring them for life possibly. Wicked content! <laughs> Let's take a look. This one might not be fake. The The reaction seems kind of real, but you never know, do you? So, let's take a peek. Next meme. Ooh. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to a brand new video. So much emotion. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome, Welcome back to a brand, brand new video. video. My brother thought it'd be funny to do a dead brother prank on me, which you can see right here. To help me out with the prank, I've got some mini fireworks here, which I'm going to be putting inside of the toaster to make a really loud bang. And to make the prank even more believable, I've got some baking soda right here and some vinegar, which I'm going to be taking right before everything goes down to make a foam effect. So it looks like I've just got a huge electric shock or some kind of seizure just to scare the <coughs> Amy. He's thought of everything. He's thought of every way he can make his brother think that he's dying on the floor, helpless, foaming at the mouth, seizing with sparks flying out of the toaster that's just probably killed him. So, so fun, happy fun times this is. Well done with your happy fun times. I'm good. 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 Best way to act inconspicuous: whistle to yourself. <laughs> I'm not doing anything. <laughs> Ignore me putting fireworks in the toaster. <laughs> and the Oscar goes to. Man, I can't get the toast out of the bloody toaster. Did you hear that? I can't get the toast out of the bloody toaster. I'm gonna stick a knife in it. Good idea, no? Press the what? What are you talking about? Mm. The Oscar goes.
And by the way, this has nearly 3 million views. 3 million impressionable kids are watching this thinking, Oh, that looks like a great idea. I could replicate that. I could, I could do that. I could stick a knife very close to the insides of a toaster whilst it's on, shove fireworks in it, I drink all this weird stuff, act like I'm dead, cause my family members to be scarred for life. I could do that. Looks pretty easy, actually. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> God's sake, man. It's terrible. Yeah, okay. In his later videos, sometimes he'll say, don't try this at home, which, which will probably just push people into trying it even more because that's what people like to do, don't they? They like to do stupid things like this. And but, but in this video, no, no warning at all. In fact, it explains every step of the process so all of you can try it yourselves. And that's the thing with YouTube. So many kids don't understand that these things are fake most of the time. So they, they don't really understand the implications that, it, that it are going into doing a prank like this. It's terrible, really. It's a pretty messed up world we live in. Hmm. Anyway, that's, that's, that's a little feel of Robin Burrell's channel. I might have a look at some more of his videos in the future. But yeah, if you enjoyed the video, please do leave it a like and subscribe if you want to help support me and my channel. Thank you so much, guys. <laughs> I will see you in the next one. Take care now.